From time immemorial to the dawn of the 20th century, uncountable people succumbed to a tiny insect called mosquito, the sting of which causes malaria. A doctor's fight against this epidemic disease becomes myth and every Kolkatan takes pride in him. Sir Ronald Ross, a British doctor, was born in Almora, India in the same year of the Sipai Mutiny 1857. After graduating in medicine in 1879, Ross entered the Indian Medical Service and served in the 3rd Anglo-Burmese War in 1885. On leave, he studied bacteriology in London from 1888 to 1889 and then returned to India, where, prompted by Patrick Manson's guidance and assistance, he began a series of investigations on malaria in 1895. He discovered the presence of the malarial parasite within the Anopheles mosquito in 1897. Using birds that were sick with malaria, he was soon able to ascertain the entire life cycle of the malarial parasite. Sir Ronald Ross made his first major breakthrough in the study of malaria while working in Secunderabad. It was there that he raised 20 mosquitoes in 1897 and let them feed on a malaria patient's blood. On August 20, Ross discovered the malarial parasite in the stomach of one of his mosquitoes. The next day, he confirmed that it was growing. 20th August is now commemorated as World Mosquito Day. It was in Kolkata the next year at the Presidency General Hospital, now the SSKM Hospital, that Ross confirmed how the parasite spread. Ross became Kolkata's first Nobel laureate and also the United Kingdom's first and the first Nobel laureate born outside of Europe. He was awarded Nobel Prize for Physiology or Medicine in 1902 for his work on malaria and received many honors throughout his latter life. His discovery of the malarial parasite in the gastrointestinal tract of the Anopheles mosquito led to the realization that malaria was transmitted by Anopheles and laid the foundation for combating the disease. His work enabled the development of methods for fighting the disease. To commemorate his breakthrough, a memorial was installed at the SSKM hospital unveiled by Ronald Ross himself in 1927. In addition to his scientific achievements, Ross was a published novelist who also composed songs and poems. Three stanzas of a poem he wrote to his wife after first discovering the parasite in the mosquito stomach are engraved on one of the plaques of the memorial along with the bus relief image of the doctor. This day relenting God hath placed within my hand a wondrous thing and God be praised at his command seeking his secret deeds with tears and toiling breath I find thy cunning saves. O million murdering death I know this little thing a myriad men will save O death where is thy sting the victory O grave